Hey everyone, today we're looking at add-ons that don't deserve their rarity. They're high in rarity, but awful. We're going to cover add-ons green and up. I may do a counterpart later on for add-ons that are below green, but are actually really good. Keep in mind for this, I'm trying to avoid add-ons I've discussed in previous similar videos, so if something really obvious doesn't appear, that's probably why. Let's get into it. Distorted Photo is a Sadako add-on that will make survivors scream, revealing them for 4 seconds if the survivor sees you manifest within 16 meters of them. This is a purple and has pretty much no application or usage. I got maybe one helpful thing out of this, and that was when I was chasing someone and I demanifested and revealed a survivor I didn't know was there. But that was it. The rest of the times I just randomly made people scream mid-chase to literally no effect. This add-on is truly awful, particularly as it has the requirement of survivors needing to be looking at you. If it worked without needing this as a requirement, it might actually be okay, and a valid yellow or something. But as is, it's just straight terrible. Pig House Gloves are a Billy add-on, and they immediately have the requirement of your chainsaw needing to be overheated, which to me just almost instantly kills this add-on out of the gate. When your chainsaw is overheated, you gain a 20% boost to break speed and a 50% reduction to pallet stuns. This sounds really nice, but it never activates really. I tried to use my chainsaw as much as I could, and not once did this add-on activate naturally. Naturally. I had to purposefully overheat it. I purposefully overheated once at a pallet, but I could have just used my chainsaw and cut down time in the chase if I wanted to. This add-on is really just worthless, particularly for a purple. It's kind of like a training add-on, I would say and so should be a brown or something. That falls in line with the other add-ons of that rarity, that help to streamline gameplay and make up for mistakes. Red Herb is an add-on for Wesker, and it increases the time it takes to use a spray can by two seconds. Nemesis has a slightly better counterpart add-on, with it also increasing the duration of instinct after using the vaccine by 1.5 seconds. Not that that makes much of a difference. Strange too, because that one's brown, and Wesker's is green. Wesker, I suppose, can get more value out of it, as survivors are able to cleanse more frequently, but still a green for a two second delay. Wesker has six crates, with each spray having two uses, meaning at most, which will largely never happen, you're getting up to 24 seconds delay, typically at points two when the survivors are already in downtime making it not that effective. Very strange add-on, that would work well as a common, maybe. Disfigured Ear is a hag add-on, and is just really strange. It applies a unique effect named Deafen, which mildly muffles your game sound for a duration of 6 seconds. It's barely noticeable, and doesn't really do anything as an add-on. The old version of this effect used to near mute your audio, and gave this high-pitched sound, but I believe it was reworked because it was sometimes slow slightly painful to listen to. Now it's just this really pathetic effect, and should probably just be reworked entirely. Depth Gauge Rake is a Bubba add-on that makes your chainsaw movement speed 2% slower, and makes it charge 22% slower. You do, however, get a fourth charge. This just kinda sucks, and is just not really a trade-off that's ever worthwhile for Bubba. Three sweeps is typically enough, and the slower speed is a really horrendous downside when the charge up and sweep can already feel a bit underwhelming and slow at times. This might be effective on an open map like Shelter Woods or something, but aside that, really awful, and there's basically no upside here. I can imagine a flip of this add-on, where you give up a token for extra speed, could be effective. But I think slowing you down is just wholly counterproductive, particularly on Bubba. Wakizashi Saya is a strange spirit add-on that allows you to return to your husk when phasing by pressing a button. This is an add-on that actually sounds quite good, but in practice, it really isn't effective. The main reason for this being that most survivors when facing spirit and seeing you phasing will simply leave the loop or the 
the area, and they won't bother with trying to face the mind games, they'll instead try to make distance. This add-on I found some usage in. I think early into the game I pulled off a vaguely good play with it, but I think it was more luck. This one is purple, and it really feels more like a meme add-on or something like that. Nurse has a similar add-on with Jenna's Lost Breath, which also isn't very good. However, the concept I think works better on Nurse, and you get a blink return too after it's used, making it a bit more worthwhile. BFFs for Legion is one of the most interesting add-ons in the game, with it actually working with tokens, which is a cool quirk. Unfortunately, it's just kind of awful, for its rarity at least. You gain tokens when you chain together Feral Frenzy hits, each granting a different number based on the length of the chain. If you hit 15 stacks when the endgame comes around, you gain a 4% boost to movement speed when out of your power. This is really niche for its rarity, and provides very little value. It could maybe secure you a down in the endgame, but it has such strange restrictions like it not being active whilst in your power, and needing to gain it in the first place. On top of that, if you play well enough, this add-on doesn't even come into play at any point, making its purpose kind of unclear. Scarlet Egg is an add-on for Executioner, and will extend the duration of instinct when a survivor touches a trail of torment by 1.5 seconds. Oh. I hate instinct-based add-ons, they are quite possibly the most worthless things in the game, maybe the most worthless add-on type and this is a purple for 1.5 seconds extra instinct. It doesn't even help when trying to predict with your power, as the instinct will always be a bit delayed, and kind of behind the survivor. Drop of Perfume is a Twins add-on, we have to mention a Twins add-on somewhere in here, I think. I chose this one because it just seems so narrow in application. It's another one I don't really get the purpose of. It would be a decent common, I think, but a purple just plainly makes no sense. This add-on makes survivors who enter Victor's radius whilst he's dormant become oblivious, and I believe it literally means that. When he's dormant and when you're in the radius, which is just 12 meters. So it's gonna trigger, like, Never, basically. Even utilizing this in a high traffic area, the oblivious status drops once you're out of that 12 meter range, and Victor ideally isn't going to be idle for very long at any given time. So the application of this add-on is just kind of bizarre I feel, particularly for a purple. If it persisted after they left the range or something, it would be marginally better. But as is, this is just bad. It's meant to pair up I think with the instinct you get when they're in range, making it so they're oblivious and you can see them, but this is such a rare circumstance where a survivor is going to remain in that area, and even then, there's still a good chance they see you coming. In fact, if they hadn't realized they were in Victor's radius before, they may know now because of the oblivious being inflicted. Plant 43 vines are an add-on for Nemesis that makes supply crates take 4 seconds longer to open. This will, at most, delay survivors by 16 seconds. Why does this exist, and why is it anything above? Of a common. At minimum, this should increase it by closer to 6 or 8 seconds, and it should be a brown or a yellow. A maximum 16 second delay, similar to Red Herb for Wesker, at a point where the survivors are already in some downtime. The only way I can maybe see this coming in handy is slowing survivors down as they open a crate with a zombie nearby, and it forces them off it for a bit. But I mean that's going to be quite rare. Alright, well, that's gonna do it. I do hope you enjoyed, and let let me know if there's something I missed, which you would add to this list down below. Thanks, and goodbye.